I want to look at a new tool in the OneNote. It's called Immersive Reader. Now, you may not see Immersive Reader in the OneNote that you're using. You need to make sure that you're actually using the correct version. On your laptop, if you type in OneNote, you'll see a version called 2016. That's not the version that has the Immersive Reader. It's the one that's just called OneNote. And if you select that and make sure that you're linked into your school account, you'll be able to go to View and Immersive Reader. Now, I've got some text here. So what we're going to do is show you how to use Immersive Reader for your students. So I don't have to select the text. I just have that page up. I'm on View and I click on Immersive Reader. The ability well, the, the use for an immersive reader is for those students who are struggling with your reading, with their reading, understanding what the words are, but they also may have dyslexia. So we can change the colour background, or the students can change their colour background, depending on what is their preference. They can change their font size. We can take, you know, go from small line spacing to a larger line spacing and also change the font type. We also have the ability to break it down into syllables, identify what are the nouns, what are the verbs, and also the adjectives as well. You can see that there. A little bit harder, but obviously the students who have dyslexia will be able to see that subtle difference. Now, the other thing that we can do is also change it with the line focus. So if the students are hard, having difficulty looking at a block of text, they can split it down into single line, a couple of lines, and a larger line focus there. So we can take that all. But the great thing about it is we can now get it to read to us in a very realistic voice by clicking on the voice down here. Case study. Background information on Sunshine Coast Social Media Limited, SCSM Limited. Felix Chelberg is an experienced YouTuber who has recently purchased the company Sunshine Coast Social Media Limited. So it's highlighting the words as it's reading it so the students can be listening to this. You also have some other settings of changing the voice speed and if you want to change it to a male voice as well. Limited. Felix purchased the company wanting to be his own boss. However, he knows very little about the voice you've selected, so obviously that's not available at the moment. So, but you have that ability for your students. Obviously, this is something that they have to do on their laptop, but if we show the students, uh, they will be more likely to use that in their own study and also in, in class time as well with their headphones on. Thanks for listening.